time for some more of this. It's been a week. I've forgotten all of the things that I don't know, so uh, that I should be in good shape. I've forgotten how not to do the puzzles. Should I? I remember what that is, so we're not going there. Should I? No, let's not start every stream by going fat backwards. Let's go forward. Is this something? Circle the square. Circle the square without touching triangles. Allegedly. Backwards? Not okay. Anything else? Not okay. Every white space must be half filled with triangles. Could be they have to be alternating or could just could just be half full. <laughs> <laughs> that was very short. We didn't even figure out for sure if that's what it was. Could I have... Uh, no? Nope. Don't care. Five. Alright. Starburst to starburst. By any means. Not that means, though. I thought that would have been it. Hmm. Just you have to leave two? No. Oh, what could it be then? No, oh, obviously it's can't it's not. That's great. That yeah, it didn't like that. It was like, hey, you're hmm. Draw a line and you're leaving for oh, real 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 quick. What were some of the first ones here? Oh. This was just... F Touch every, every blank and square. That was it? Touch every blank and square? There's a begin and no, no, I don't remember what this was. I figured it out apparently. <clears throat> Was it begin next to a square but don't end next to a square? Begin next to something but don't end next to anything. No. No, wow. Uh-oh. <laughs> All right, so I have no hints to go on from the previous ones. There we 
right, back back to the beginning. Going around the outside works. Going through the middle works, which creates a two and two. Zigzagging works. Anything that takes up more than five squares does not work. Now anything that uses seven squares and leaves two works. Anything? Anything. Anything that uses seven squares and leaves two. So is this just going to be use nine square? Well, I no, I can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, One and two are start and end on a star burst. Three is touch all of them. Three seems to be touch all of them. But whatever whatever four is, I don't got it. That satisfies the four, but not the three. That does not, though, even though it's the right number of boxes. satisfies the four is it just you ha ha man is that's confusing which makes sense it's supposed to be confusing Oh, I guess because it's got one more, one, oh wait, did I, did I just fail to count? Is it, whoops. Is this seven, not five? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wow. <laughs> I don't know why I did five when I first showed up. And so this should be nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, no. Start with this. One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Huh, okay. 
It was much easier than I thought. <laughs> so they're trying to throw me off there. This seemingly has nothing to do with whether you whether you touch the the thing or not. Is it every square around the star must be touched? Whether you hit the star or not? Possibly. That's fine. That's fine. No matter what, I'm satisfying too. No clue what one could be. Is one hit every star? And then two is do something mysterious that I've accidentally done every time so far. <laughs> I'm like, nope. For no reason, now you are in violation. What is different? I mean, there's four now. Maybe it's only hit two of them. Oh, finally a dong. Why, what's wrong, what's wrong with this? And was it wrong over here? Right, so it has something it has to have something to do with the path. It's not just which squares whoops are filled in. It's something to do with the path that you take. But that was okay.
I guess it's that I have to hit them in order. As long as I hit the top. <laughs> hit the squares in order. I guess top to top to bottom and left to right. So this one and then this one and then this one and this one. No. So this was second. This one was first, but this one is second. <laughs> is it this one first, and then this, and then this? And then like both of those and this and this? No. That's why I guess that. So I've got the order figured out here. None of the other order Oh, the other order did work. Oh, is it just from the outside in? This didn't work. All right, outside in, but not like that. Okay. Fair enough. Is it like corners? Nope. Can't leave this guy alone. Oh, nope. Same thing here, the corner, the corner comes before the side. Is it a matter of like distance from the center? But that would mean hit this and this and this before hitting any of the others, which is not possible. I'll declare that right away. Unless, no, not possible. So what if not that? <laughs> if there's no way to hit these three corners without, there clearly isn't, because there's no way to get from one of these to the other without drawing a line that separates one side from the other. Like, that, like so, or like so, or like so. Maybe opposite is also okay. Clearly not. Not possible. What a ridiculous rule. Yeah, that doesn't work.
hello backslash o slash colon ever space x space x are you elon musk have you secretly been elon musk this whole time This one is very tricky. So what it seems to be is you need to hit every star and you need to hit them in a specific order. How am I today? Uh, I, I didn't go to bed until like 8 a.m. <laughs> and then slept until like 2. And then also took a nap uh, for like two hours before stream. So I'm doing a lot of, a lot of odd sleeping. I don't know how I'm going to fix that. Other than the sleep, uh, I guess I'm okay. How are you? This puzzle is definitely that you you have to hit all the the st stars, whatever, sunbursts. You have to hit them in a specific order. You have to start on one. You have to end on one, right? Did I try that as well? You do not have to end on one. old person stuff that's me it's how i roll in my wheelchair for old people so we have seven stars here the order that they need to be hit in would seem to be that you hit the ones that are farthest from the center first meaning this one and this one and this one and then these two and then the two in the middle, but that's not possible. So I have something wrong. There's something less specific that can be done. But I don't know what it is. Can I ignore stars that I don't like? satisfies number two because I'm I'm now correctly going from out to in right that doesn't but that does indeed so that makes it seem like I have it correct that 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 I'm doing the second part, which is hit them in the correct order, uh, but I'm not hitting this one. So is there a way to do it? Like, this is wrong. That's fine. And that's fine. And that's fine. But how would I include more things? Now it's like, hey, you got the one because you hit them all, but you're not hitting them in the right order. That's the right order. This isn't the right order? That's not. That is. That's fine. The rule is, rule rule one is hit every starburst, satisfied. Rule two is 
every star that you starburst you hit needs to be in the correct order and the order so far has been start from the outside and work your way in out to in out to in specifically doing the corner first out to in doing both of the corners first doing all four of the sides before you hit the corners and then here where everything that I know says that this that it's like yeah it says both of these are correct but this is not meaning both of these are equal you can hit either one of these first you can hit either one of these first either one of those either one of those but this from here to here you're going in so for some reason both of these are equivalent Okay, so hit all four of these, then either one of these, and then that? Why, though? It is a mystery. to lower those are equal this is this has got to go to the left out 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 see now the correct thing is to start in the middle and work your way out whoops go to the first yeah first is real easy if you start on this one and then pass through here you get it if you start on here and then that one you don't get it and you can hit whatever you want along the way You don't even have to end on a star. Those are equal. Those are equal. This has to come first. Yeah, this... Uh... That's so strange. Maybe whichever one is just, no, no, I have no idea. Whichever, no, nope. Stumped utterly. Hit them all, hit one. Right, hit them all. Come on now. One rule, one rule, and I'm doing it. And it's like, no.
why? <laughs> is it because this is puzzle number one, two, three, and this is four? We have a one by three, two by three, four by three, three by one by three, two by three, three by four, and then two by two, three by three, you know. Why though? <laughs> it does have s something to do with the stage number. Because they kept getting. I, I assume it did. Remind me to look this one up after I'm done with the game. <laughs> Mystifying. And then four, they're like, fill in one row out of the two. And then fill in one row out of the... Okay, and vertical also helps. Eight is a three by six. This is a four by eight. Primes? Composites? Same thing again? This, this seems like almost completely arbitrary. What? Is it just divide it in half if it's no? Okay, it has nothing to do with the shape at all either. It's fill in exactly that many squares. For some reason, on this one it's three, then six, then three, then four, then nine, then eight, then six, then nine, right? Because this would have, that's also fine. Oops, stop. Gosh. 
Wait, is this one not going to be a whole number? Wah. Yeah. Every single one so far has been, but this is not. Three, six, three, four, nine, eight, six, nine. And now what is this? Now we don't need to look it up. And this is one by three. Two by three, three by four, four, nine. Oh, well, I'm writing down the wrong things. Oh, is Is it non-airy? We're, we're leaving white space that is multiples of nine. The total number of squares... Look at this. Three squares. Six squares. Twelve squares. But if you were to write twelve as a non-airy number, it would be one, two. So we fill in one and two squares. 4, 9, 8, this is 24, which is 2 and 4, this is 18, which is 1 and 8, this is 32, which is 3 and 2, this is just the whole thing, 30, wait, isn't it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, by 4, is 36. So is it just 3 and 6? It is. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 by 6. 8 by 6 is. F uh, oh, so wait. So it's not it's not non airy. <laughs> it, it works out seeming to be 9 based because we're in base 10. So what did I just say? Uh, 8 and 6, 48, 4. Eight. So what was the last one? What was this? This was 3, 6, 12. Six, twenty-four. Yeah, I definitely phrased it weirdly because I noticed that the number of squares that were left over was a multiple of nine. And I was like, ah, that's. Or, or actually, the first thing that I noticed is that it it wasn't. It was always fill in all of the squares until we got to some until we got to things that were above nine and then it changed. Two X three uh three X four two X two three X three two X four Six X four six X three uh, eight X four 
This is the most confusing. Why would this one fill in everything? And eight x six. Oops, no, not like that. Something special about all of... No, this one will remain a mystery. Ten, though. Keep them separated. It's the offspring. You got it? Go for it. What was it? <laughs> I love math more than you. You shut up. All right, so this is make two identical things. Do I believe that? Size is this like six divided by wait, what? <laughs> He said six, six divided by two, six divided by three. Twelve divided by two, or twelve divided by three, twelve divided by four. Four divided by two, two, okay. I mean, I guess both of these are squares. This is not a square. Um, I don't. I don't know what. I don't know. That's too vague. I don't understand. <laughs> six. Six divided by two is three. Six divided by three is two. And then you multiply those together and you get six again. Okay. The length of the line. But isn't that always the case? Right, you go here, you got 24. 12 is divisible by 6 and 4. But so is 24. 24 is divisible by 6 and 4. Oh, the height, height and... No. Shortest. No, it seems like 12, 12 is, the... oh, the, the short, oh my god, smallest common factor, or least, least common, least common denominator, whatever, that's exactly it, least common denominator, least common denominator of 1 and 3 is 3, 2 and 3 is 6, or no, wait, yes, exactly, least common denominator. Of 3 and 4 is 12. Of 2 and 2 is 2. 3 and 3, 3. 2 and 4, 4. 
4 and 6, 12. 3 and 6, 6. 4 and 8, 8. 4 and 9, 36. 3 and... Sorry, 6 and 8, 24. That, that seems incredibly obvious in retrospect. <laughs> Which I guess if I had gotten that, then the next one would have been more difficult, because <laughs> I would have I would have been in the the wrong mode of thinking. <laughs> so how? All right, we got to look at the things. All right, so one would seem to be don't touch any, don't touch anything. Rule one is don't touch anything. This rule three, we get rule three, and here we get rule three. Here we do not. Mm. Okay. Don't just give it to me. <laughs> So this has something to do with symmetry, surely. This is no good because the squares are at the edges. But this is okay. Okay. Is it just make shapes that have circles at the. No? Because here, this isn't okay. But this is. Oh. Oh. What? Why isn't that it? Certainly. Oh, here it is. Oops. Game. You told me for certain that I was allowed to do this. Am I allowed to? Rule one is don't touch anything. That's fine, but none of the others that I tried were fine. <laughs> 
Does every white space have to be... No, there's no reasoning. There's no reasoning with this game. No, this one I'm not even close to understanding. You don't get a whole lot of room for experimentation. And then when you do, there's only one there's only one right answer. Like this was wrong. But this is right. This didn't get either rule or two or, two or three. Yeah, two and three seem to be very separate. I got rule three. Why is there even a rule three? I don't get it. No good. No good. These two have to... Anything that involves going in this square disrupts. Okay, so... Rule three, do not ever go between a circle and square that are one apart. See? Didn't break it. Didn't break it. Didn't break it. Okay. All of these other squares are fine. Okay, so just don't don't go there. Try to do who knows what. Always start the line before finishing it. What if I had a black hole generator? I don't think the rules apply to me then. This is fine. It's good enough. Isn't it? So rule three is don't, don't go It's not just don't go next to a square at all. It's don't go next to any... No. 
don't don't go between a circle and a non-circle. Then what's rule two? Here is a rule too. That's not. That is also a rule too. Seems to be based. Hmm. That's also a rule too. And so is that. Is it there? There must exist a See, then it's wrong. There must exist a space that has a circle. Nope. <laughs> Every space that exists must have a circle. One, exactly one circle. That's not good enough. All right, that's a violation, but it's still good. Yikes. Yikers, as the kids say. God, this one, yeah. All right, let's leave that one alone. 